Harry and Meghan have supposedly snagged themselves a charming little slice of Portugal, and rumor has it that this move is part of their grand plan to become the rival royals. Yes, the couple who voluntarily left the royal family now seem to want to maintain a bit of that royal flair, just from across the water. According to a royal commentator, the duo is heading to Portugal to boost their royal appeal. Richard Eden from the Daily Mail speculates that this could be the start of their Europe-wide takeover, using their new Portuguese home as a base of operations. But this isn't just any move. They've already made waves in Nigeria and Colombia with what some call quasi-royal tours, because if there's one thing Harry and Meghan need, it's more titles with quasi in front of them. Joining them in this Portuguese palace could be Princess Eugenie and her husband, Jack Brooksbank, who spend half their time there. Is a new rival royal court being formed? As for Meghan, the one-time potential British citizen who doesn't seem too keen on that anymore, there's talk of a seeking a golden visa, a ticket to roam around Europe with a touch of quasi-royal magic. Even though Portugal's golden visa program may be closing soon, the Sussexes seem to have snagged their spot just in time. And who's the mastermind behind this luxurious move? Mike Meldman, the king of celebrity schmoozing and the man behind Costa Terra, the development where Harry and Meghan may have purchased land. Meldman is no stranger to the celebrity circuit, dropping names like Tom Brady and Reese Witherspoon to keep the buzz going. Naturally, Harry and Meghan fit right in with this glamorous crowd. Oh, and did we mention that Paris Hilton may have bought land in this development too? It's turning into a star-studded senior citizen playground. But not everything is as perfect as it seems. There are whispers that the land is in a protected area, making development tricky. But hey, why not invest in a project that might never be built, right? Meanwhile, back in Montecito, Harry and Meghan have settled into what is essentially a posh retirement community for the ultra-wealthy. Ironically, the Duchess who tried to be Hollywood's young, hip mom is now living where rich people go to pretend they are still relevant after cashing in their millions. Speaking of millions, Meghan kind of skipped the part where you actually make them and went straight to pretending. And what about their kids, Archie and Lilibet? The royal tots seem to be missing in action every time Harry and Meghan jet off for their next adventure. While other royals, like the Cambridge, let their kids enjoy normal moments like ice cream outings. Archie and Lilibet seem to be under lock and key. Maybe they are living in Portugal, waiting for their parents' next big move. At the end of the day, this rumored Portuguese house is just another chapter in the Sussex's ongoing soap opera, full of grand plans that may or may not go anywhere, just like that alleged house. If you enjoyed this breakdown of royal drama, make sure to subscribe to Fame Finder for more juicy updates. Don't forget to like this video and drop your thoughts in the comments below.